How often do Tesla's batteries fail? In this video, I take a look at 135 owners from around the globe and analyze how often their battery packs fail. Before I do that, I'd like to make a few points about a similar survey that I analyzed back in 2018. The survey that was done had 536 owners from around the globe and a battery failure rate of 5.6% or 30 battery packs. I'll mention a few interesting points about this older survey. 83% failed before 60,000 miles. 93% failed before 80,000 miles, and the two outliers failed around 140,000 miles. One of those battery packs was actually mine. And you can see that the majority of the battery pack sizes represented in this older survey was the 85 kilowatt hour pack. And even though there were some smaller and larger packs than the 85, the 85 seemed to fail the most, and the performance version of that 85 kilowatt hour pack represented 67% of those failures. Now let's take a look at the survey data that I received in the last few weeks. We've got a pretty wide range of Tesla models here, but the majority of them are the Model 3 and Model Y. Of the 135 owners from around the world who entered in their information here, 7.4% experienced a battery failure, or 10 battery packs of those 135. Of those 10 battery packs, 80% failed before 100,000 miles. And 60% of those battery failures failed between 50 and 100,000 miles. Drilling down even further into battery failure by model, 30% were the 85 kilowatt hour pack, 10% was the 75 kilowatt hour pack, and the other 60% are some variant of the Model 3 and Model Y. One thing to note here is that the performance version of the Model 3 appears to fail much more often than non-performance versions. So what are my key takeaways after analyzing this data? One of them is that 7.4% experience battery failure. Now, though that's a minority, most people don't experience battery failure, that still seems quite high and is higher than the data that I analyzed back in 2018. I think that it would be far better if the battery failure rate was at around one or 2%. Battery failure creates a frustration and inconvenience for the owner and lowering that inconvenience and frustration is fundamental to the total customer experience. The second takeaway from this data is that if your battery pack is going to fail, it's probably going to fail between 50 and 100,000 miles. And this is right in line with Tesla's battery warranty for the current Model S and X. It is an eight year or 150,000 mile warranty. For the Model 3 rear wheel drive, it's eight year or 100,000 miles. And for the rest of the Model 3 and Model Y variants, it's an eight year or 120,000 miles. And the last takeaway from this data is that if you've got a performance Model 3, you are three times more likely for your battery pack to fail than non-performance versions. That wraps up this video. This survey is still active, so if you haven't filled out that information and you'd like to contribute to the greater good and greater insight of Tesla battery packs, I'd love it. And I'll probably do a, an updated version of this in a year or two, so feel free and fill that out. I'll put the link in the video description as well as pin it to a comment. What are your thoughts on this? Have you experienced a battery pack failure? How many miles do you have on your Tesla? I'd love to hear in the comments down below. My name is Sean Mitchell with All Things EV. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you on the next one.